We have continuing coverage tonight. A man is in the hospital recovering after a deputy involved shooting in Fresno County this afternoon. It started with a domestic violence call. CBS 47's Shauna Kalafi is live at Community Regional Medical Center with reaction to the shooting. Shauna. This happened at a home on Ashland Avenue between Greenwood and Academy and Sanger. And that's an area that neighbors tell me is usually pretty quiet and safe. Just before 12.30 this afternoon, the Fresno County Sheriff's Office responded to a domestic violence call at a home in Sanger, saying a man was choking a woman. When deputies arrived, the woman had gotten out safely, but two young children were still inside with the suspect. But that was a big concern that here was this man that was exhibiting violence that actually just choked this woman, and now he was still close to these two small children. Deputies surrounded the home and spent over an hour trying to get the man to come outside. He finally came out holding multiple bladed weapons and started to approach the deputies. That's when one deputy fired at him with a handgun while another fired a beanbag rifle at the same time, both hitting the suspect at least once. Didn't seem to phase the suspect that much. He continued to be combative and want to fight with the deputies. A third deputy then used a taser to take him into custody. The sheriff's office hasn't confirmed exactly how many shots were fired, but a neighbor says he heard six loud noises. I had the thought that it, it could have been gunshots, but I couldn't hear it clearly enough, you know, through the walls and everything to completely identify it. The suspect was airlifted to the hospital and is expected to survive. No deputies were injured.